Right, we're at the workshop. Um, I've had to get I've had to get stuck in already. I couldn't wait for the camera to be set up, so I've uh, loosened and bashed and had a little uh, soak up of the for me. And um, I've decided that the first job I want to do is take the doors off because I want it to look instantly like I've done something. So uh, first tool, impact driver. With the right size bit for this, you've got your four self-tapping screws. Uh, I'm just going to dive straight into the job. And so I've loosened these up already, but I've loosened them up with this. That noise is the heater because it's freezing, obviously. Um, <clears throat> club, that's loose. That one's already loose. The bottom two, different kettle of fish, of course, because it's more uh, more water makes it down to the bottom and rust the bolts up. So uh, I've given them a good. Show you a little trick anyway. The bottom one, the very bottom one has gone, and I've done it already. And trick for getting the doors out because we're going to replace all the nuts and bolts. And if you're doing it, it's just not worth not replacing nuts and bolts. You can get some nice um, stainless steel kits. And what we want to do is drill the head off the bolt so the drill bit goes through, meets the um, thread, the threaded part, the head falls off and then the thread isn't doing anything, so uh, it's a nice little trick and if you come down here, hopefully, we'll see the results. If you look in there, I've drilled the head off and there it is, just drilled through it, weakened it and then punched the thread through and uh, that's it. Now I've got to unwind this bolt. It was supposed to be all ready to go, but uh, now it's started to go loose. Ah, uh -huh. snapped as well. Brilliant. That's saved some work. When I get the door off, I'll show you the clips on that. Right. If we uh, if we nip round the um, we nip round the other side, I'll show you where the um, check strap is. It's the easy one. Right, here's one I prepared earlier. Oh, that's weird to say that. Right, um, there's the little um, clip that holds the door check strap on, stops the door opening up too far. And once you've got that out, top and the bottom bolts are very easy. And let's see if this one will come out. It's a clip. Dropped it. There you go. Good. So this is why you can drill them, butcher them. Because, not the right tool, I forgot I was going to do this while we were standing here. Oh, I've dropped that one as well. Brilliant. Anyway, they just look in, I'm not getting myself over excited to look that out. They hook themselves in, so if you've got a bit of studding left in, you can just get your screwdriver under there, bend them out, chuck them away, get new ones. Right, we are doing the bulkhead, so it's going to be. Um, Big job, but we're going to do uh, as little as possible to get it out. So, uh, somebody said to me you can get it out without taking the windscreen off from the roof, so I thought we'd have a go. It's all really loose. All I've undone is this here. That's the hinge on the outside. Big screw through the top. Two Allen key bolts. Uh, loosen that off. Goes in there. Pop that down out of the way. And uh, there it comes. Same crap with getting anything off, it goes to the compressor. Drill it out if you can't get it off and just hammer and chisel it. Or drill that out, stick something in there, bend the head off. Same with that, drill it out, hammer and chisel the head off, whatever you've got to do. Because as long as you've got a bit of studding on there, you can always pinch it up in the vise. Or um, weld a nut to the top and let some heat go down there and extract it. Right, leave the door shut while you undo the last two hinges, the last two bolts, and then the door won't fall on the floor, you can do it on your own, undo the two bolts and then pop the door, and here it is on the floor. So, that's it, job done, all off in one in. No, no stripping necessary to get to the, the check strap, or the hinges, or anything, it's all good. Right, I'll put the other door off, and we'll do the next bit. Back in a second. 